bitches, welcome back to my channel. Sincerely Sam with Sam. That's me. So I apologize for my hair. I slept in this bun all night. Um, and I think I'm just gonna take it down when I'm finished everything. But so today's video is going to be me creating the tiny face illusion uh, from my nose up. Now, uh, this should be quite interesting. I saw this challenge done about a month ago by I think a woman named uh, Jamie French. Um, she did it about a month or so ago. Uh, I didn't have a channel back then, so uh, I didn't have a platform to attempt this, but I want to attempt it, so let's get into that. And yeah, let's get into it. So I'm gonna put some foundation on. I'm gonna remove those coats because I feel like it's like just like this weird dark looming shadow like a Dementor. Dementor in the corner. Okay. Hang on. Okay. That's better. Okay. So we're gonna put on some foundation. Now I, I, I'm I'm pretty much a basic bitch when it comes to makeup. Um, I do musical theater absolutely um, and I love doing it um, ooh, someone's texting me. Uh, but I don't have like a lot of weird tricks or fancy things that I do. I wish I did. I feel like it just takes too much time and effort. <laughs> Ain't nobody got time for that. Well, at least I don't. I mean, I got time for that now. So I should be trying to experiment, but is what it is. So what we're doing right now, just finishing that up. All right. I have never used Beauty Blender. I bought one because uh, I ran out of my supplies the other day. So I just bought like a whole bunch of stuff, and yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna get fancy. We're gonna use a Beauty Blender. In fact. I think I might even move you guys a little closer so you can see my pretty face. How's that? Cool. All right, let's use the Blurder Beauty Blender. And we'll get right into it. And we're gonna beat this face. Okay. Beat it so it's so beautiful. Okay, so fun fact, I attempted to do this um, a few weeks ago, which is probably why you're like, Sam, you didn't post the other day. Uh, yeah, you are correct. I did not. Uh, mostly because um, I actually, um, I was feeling kind of meh, and my uh, sister was gonna go up to see our parents, in Penticton um, she wasn't able to go anymore but my niece was still going up so I decided to go up to Penticton to uh, visit with my parents with my niece for a week um, so I had finished this <laughs> I had attempted to do this video once before and I had it all ready and it was edited it was ready to go uh, but I wasn't quite ready to post yet. I had to make a thumbnail and all that stuff, so I didn't uh, post it. Instead, I left it on my computer and I was like, oh, I'll post it when I get up there. Um, so I get up there, I sort of finished it, but then I needed, I don't know, I feel like sometimes you just need confirmation um, that it's not a super terrible video. So I attempted to send it to uh, a friend of mine so she could kind of tell me how badly it sucked. <laughs> it doesn't suck. Um, but I, yeah, so I sent it to her to get confirmation um, and it just, it wasn't sending properly. And then I was like, okay, well, maybe I'll just uh, do it anyways. It just didn't work out, and then I tried to send it, then I tried to post it, but things got corrupt. So then I tried to re-edit it and send it, but some of the footage got lost. So, long story short, I was like, oh no, I have to like, redo it. <laughs> like, that's the long and the short end of it, is I was 
really upset because um, I thought I thought it was pretty good. Um, you know, I had really good content, but at the end of the day, I lost it. So this is technically a attempt number two. All right, let's use some powder. Take this in. Uh, so yeah, I'm a basic bitch when it comes to makeup. I uh, I love doing like basic makeup, but basic makeup to me is like a uh, cover up or foundation with like some powder and then like, I guess, mascara to give me something and then like some lip gloss. Like that's, that's my makeup. But I realized that uh, this is gonna require a little bit more skill. Uh, when I do, when I do like musicals, when I do musicals, it definitely is more involved. Um, like, but they're not super worried about it looking good. Like, it looks good, but at the end of the day, what they want is they want enough pigment, enough makeup where you're gonna be seen at the back. You know, the the people who paid the same amount of money. You know. They want to see the purple that you've put on your eye, you know. I have also really tiny eyes, so I appreciate a very big eyeshadow. So, like, I go up to, like, my eyebrows some days, like, you know, like Ursula. Yeah. Today we're going to get all fancy. We're going to beat this face into submission and put on a cute little face. So, we've got the basics. Let me just make sure my, my brows are on fleek. I don't know why I said that. I never say that. It sounds so stupid coming for me. Okay, so it's, what we're gonna do is we're gonna draw a nose on, on my nose. Now, the, the first time I attempted this, it did not, I f it, in the end, it went well. Uh, let's be clear. You could see it. It looked like a nose or at least a face. Uh, I'll show you some pictures at the end because I did take pictures on my phone when I was done uh, to show people. But I think, yeah, but it, it definitely took a lot of tries. So I'm going to try to get this in a shorter amount of time. Oh, Amazon's bringing my package. Ooh, that's for another video. So, um, I'm just going to zoom you in a little bit. Is that too close? Hmm, maybe. Yeah, we'll do there. Okay. So, it definitely worked when I did um, the eyeliner, but I think what will help is if I block it out again, um, with maybe like some eyeshadow or something like that. So I think that's what I'm going to do. The other thing is, is that I noticed when I tried to edit this video the first time, I could see what I was doing wrong and I couldn't tell myself how to fix it. Like I was doing like this part here and I wasn't going on a straight line. I could see I was going crooked, but you can't tell yourself that to fix it. That's like telling a horror victim not to go upstairs when she hears a creepy voice coming from the killer downstairs. Like, she's not gonna hear you. She is meant to do that. Anyway, we're gonna get into it. I want the illusion to be there. I want you guys to be like, ooh, there is a tiny face. I'm currently just looking for a little brush. Can't go so low so you guys can still see the magic. Maybe if I use the camera instead of this mirror here. Eh, we'll try. I gotta hold my head straight. That would be a good thing first. Okay. Eh. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a line. We're a quarter of the way there. Okay, so we've got to do another one on this side. I mean, it looks even in the mirror, but I've learned that's different. Um, and then we're gonna have like the bridge of the nose like here. Yeah. And then this, maybe, 
Maybe. Because like right now on the camera, not not in the mirror, but in the camera, it looks like this part here is obviously a lot more pronounced and then this one is like off. But I don't think it is. How's my nose? I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna shade a bit of it in to kind of, uh, when I do draw my nose, give it a bit more, give it a bit more like depth. I definitely think that this, uh, this nostril is a little bit more pronounced than the other one. Cause we're trying to create a face on my face. So we've got some highlights going. Right now it looks weird. <laughs> because uh, that's all that's there. So, you look good, girl. You only look like you got a notes job. I think I'm gonna try this again. Some little, some little, little ball-y things. Oh, sorry. I need she went down like this and then then you create the main part, and then I think you just, you draw the little, the little bollies, the little nostrils on the side here. I think I might try and line it. That might help me, because sometimes it's just easier to visualize it. So, I don't have any black liner so I'm gonna use brown because that's what I got I mean I got white but that's not gonna do nothing <laughs> okay so we are gonna create the little so there's like the little bridge here but I don't want to go like too dark with that right and then you got the yeah, the actual nose part of it. All right, we're going with this. Okay. Wow, it is. It is very hard to draw a nose on your little face. Okay. Uh, and I'm gonna take. I'm the law in town. I need you to straighten out, sir. Sir? Okay, so this is what we got so far. Um, I don't really, uh, I don't really know how I feel. I mean, I think it's okay. You know? I mean, we want a cute nose. You know, I think it's cute. I think she's cute. She cute nose. Let's see, do we have a little nose? Do we have a little nose? Little one. We can deal with that nose. So it's all about the layers. We're creating layers here. Because, I mean, it's not like it's gonna be a believable nose to a certain extent, but you still want the illusion to be there, so. I don't know if it's there or not. I feel like this side's probably like, could be a little bit better, this side. <clears throat> We're gonna leave it and move on because I'm hoping it'll look better. <laughs> um, We're gonna move on to the lips and then if we have to, we'll come back to the nose. But I'm hoping because, I mean, it, for the most part, it looks okay to me, but I've also discovered that things look very different to you uh, than they do to other people. Like I thought the first time didn't work out well and I was like, mm, it kind of looks okay. Uh, but everybody I showed the pictures to, um, they're like, no, 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 it looks really, really good. And I was like, oh, okay, cool. Cause like, you can't see it when you're like filming it. Uh, you can kind of see it when you're like, you know, looking back on it and all that stuff, but you can't see it. You can only, yeah really weird. So we're gonna move on to the lips. Uh, oh actually 
First thing we want to do is we want to create the little, um, what do they call it? Cupid's bow? You know, this, this little thing. We want to create it up here a little bit. Gonna blend it. I mean, yeah. All right. Okay. All right. There is something there. Some of this. I'm like... Lighten that up a little bit, you know? I think it went too dark on one side. So, guess what we're gonna do? I'm just gonna start again. Make sure not to get our nose. <laughs> Which nose? Lazo must have so shiny. I just opened that one. Although, I like a little shine in my life. Oh yeah, I forgot I bought, I was running out of stuff, so I just bought like a whole bunch of, um, palettes and stuff off Amazon to, I don't know, see if there's something I could like. Like I've got like this one. This one's okay. Uh, I've used a bit of it already. I even used some of the color. <gasps> what? You're crazy, Sam. I know. Um, so I've used some of that and I also uh, got like more of a neutral palette from e.l.f. I mean, I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm a cheap basic bitch, but I'm okay with being a basic bitch when it comes to makeup because ain't nobody got time for that. So I'm okay with what I got and who I be. Don't come for me. A better fit maybe for the Cupid's bow. There's something, huh? There's something. How's that? Man, sometimes I really wish like Disney songs and like musical theater songs weren't like super copyrighted. So I could like just like jam out to them while I'm putting on my makeups. Because I could really go for some Sherma Tube medleys. That's all I'm saying. Uh, I think we could all use like some show tunes in our lives. I feel like people would be a lot more relaxed. I'm just saying is all, you know? At a certain point it stops blending, obviously. But, oh uh, yes, the good old finger technique. Uh, I didn't have too much trouble with the Cupid's bow the first time I attempted this, so I'm not exactly sure why I'm freaking out, guys, I'm freaking out. No, I'm okay. I'll be fine. Thanks for your concern. Okay. All right. It's time to get very close to this mirror. Let's get it close. So we want to create, you see it? Okay. So we want to do, we want to do like a cute nose. And it's just weird in general, like drawing on your nose. I like always wanted to do like special effects makeup, but it's like, uh, I think that would be really like cool to do, but I don't think I have the patience for it. <laughs> Maybe one day when I'm old and I need a new hobby. All right, here's a tricky bit. We're gonna go underneath now. Yeah, I think, I think that's what we want. How do I already have it up my nose? I don't know. Okay. Mm -hmm. Am I done? Is that? I guess I gotta put on the lipstick to find out. What kind of lip should she be? Is she more of a red lip kind of gal? I think I'm gonna give her red lips. Um, I don't know how this is gonna work out, but we're just gonna go throw caution to the wind and we're just gonna be like, yeah. Let's do it. I'm worried about the Cupid's bow. That's what I'm worried about. I feel like I didn't blend it very well and I feel like it probably just looks like really, really dark. It smells nice, but it's like, well, I mean, I guess it's a good thing it smells nice because it's about to be at my nose. I just bought these lipsticks too. So like, they're, they're brand spanking new and it's like, hey, was that too dark maybe? It's like, hey. Got all these cool new, like, brand new lipsticks. 
What are you gonna do with them? Well, I'm gonna stick it in my nose. And it's gonna be beautiful. Weird stuff I'm doing. And I'm gonna be smelling lipstick for a year. You can do this. Just got to believe. Okay. Woo! And I put way too much, obviously. I'm trying to figure this out and it 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 looks like it's getting there. Like <laughs> Like it looks so good. One side looks better than the other, so I'm just trying to figure out how I can fix that. Like, she definitely has voluptuous lips. So I'm just gonna try lighten this up a little bit. I thought it was gonna be such like a great day for like, I almost put this on my regular lips, but I need it up here. Oh my God, this is so cute. I think it's working out really, really well. Okay, so I think it's I think it's at a good point right now where I think I'm just gonna finish things up here uh, And by finish things up, I mean I'm gonna put some Some basic bitch eye makeup right now Let's see. I just did I put a little bit more uh, color in my brow. I feel like it probably did a little bit too too dark uh, But I think that might just be that I'm used to seeing my eyebrows really light so I did that. I did some uh, eyeshadow, uh, and then I kind of like I kind of just like lightened up this area a little bit because I wasn't liking wasn't liking how it was looking. Um, I didn't like like the the sheer. Oh, it looks so much better f like in the camera than it does close up. Far away, it looks I think a little bit better. So I'm gonna do mascara, I'm gonna do a little bit of highlight, and then I'm gonna take my hair down for the reveal. Stay tuned. Ooh, she's so cute. <laughs> so this turtle neck doesn't quite work, because uh, it's like not quite high enough, so I'm like, meh. But this is the this is the final look that we got. Ain't she cute? She adorable. my nose all that often because when I move it. Ah, there she is! <laughs> ah, I'm terrible at moving, I'm terrible at moving my nose and just my nose because then my eyebrows just move. I know. You think I'm gorgeous. Angry face. Angry face. I think I'm gonna get something to eat. Huh? Because I'm hungry. I can't do it! I'm so wonderful and beautiful. <laughs> this is ridiculous, but it's so funny. If you like my video, like, subscribe. Thanks for watching my channel and all this ridiculousness. Until next video, bye!